Hello guys, my name is FIFA Junior and today we're going to talk about the new features for FIFA 21 that are coming to career mode. So, 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 so I know that everyone is talking about this, but this time it's going to be just you and me. You know, just talking like a friend and, you know, reading about new stuff that we're going to be happy to have in FIFA 21. So, something new that we're going to have is the interactive match theme. So, to be honest, I'm excited with this because, uh, let's see, you now you can take penalties, you can take, a, how do you say this in English? Uh, free kicks, oh my gosh, free kicks. In Spanish is tiro libre, uh, so sometimes it's, I'm confused about this. Um, Oh yeah, that is good, and also we can make some substi substitutions or changes, or we can change players, and at the same time we can play anytime in the game. So this is good, but because sometimes I don't know when you see a a match or a game, you're going to see, you're going to think like, okay, we're going to win this game, and when you see the match, you lose the game. It's like, what? Really? Come on. Come on, FIFA. <laughs> but now you can play them and it's exciting and you you can play like what the, on, only the last ten minutes if you are bored or something like that. That is good to be to improve, you know. Also, they improve the growth system. You now can change the defensive midfielders to center backs or just an example you can go your left back they can be a uh, right mid or oh, oh my gosh uh, left mid or left winger to be honest that is very good because in real life players played like that if you remember Garrett Bale he played he started playing like like a left back then he moved to a, a left mid one time he was playing as a second striker in Tottenham so that is awesome now we can do that I know that uh, you can do it like in the game but sometimes when you sim the player or the match they're going to they're not going to perform very well because you're playing like a left back in in, a, in other position that they are not that the game doesn't allow you to do it but now you can change that you can improve that so that is awesome so what else what 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 else do we have here match sharpness new attribute like ta -ta -ta. okay so now that the training system is much better that's good to know uh, what what else activity management system rest okay okay so apparently we can select one day of the week to uh, train train our players so I think that is good right because I remember that every uh, after Sunday you can train your players in career mode but now you can like select okay on Tuesday or Thursday or Friday you're going to train your players I think I think Friday is a good day right because Wednesday you have Champions League Thursday you have Europa League and Saturday Sunday or Monday you have cup games or league games. I think Friday is a good, good day to to put your training day. I think it's a good day. <laughs> so there is a tip. <laughs> um, what else? So the AI, no, come on, a AI. Yeah, the AI or the PC, or the players, uh, the system players. They're going to be much difficult. So okay, we need to improve our game to win more games, like every FIFA, I believe. <laughs> also, new ways to sign players. So make loan to buy offer with optional or mandatory. Okay, I think that is good. If I maybe I'm wrong, maybe I'm not wrong, but I believe this option we had it like in an old FIFA, but we're talking about like FIFA 12, I believe, or FIFA 14. I think we had that option before, but they remove it and now they are bringing that option back and to be honest to be honest i'm excited because sometimes you know like we like to um, sign wonder kids and sometimes we don't have the money we don't have the money so uh, let's say you ask for a loan player and then say okay in the end of the season i will i will pay you 5 million dollars for this player and they accept in that moment now you have a bargain Ta -ta. Shh, shh, shh. Oh my 
gosh, sorry. Sorry about that, guys. <laughs> what else? Custom your career mode, new initial setups, option. Okay, that is. That doesn't care, like, okay, who cares? <laughs> okay, so the three things that we have now is like the new fixtures for simulations. That now you can change the position of the player. That is awesome. I'm excited for that. And you can what what other new feature for signing players. So I think there are the three top three, of course, the top three new things that we have here in career mode. Write in your comments which of these features is your favorite and which other feature you will add to the game. You know, I will happy to read your comments. So. Thank you guys and see you in the next time.